Hello, hello and welcome to another update video about Phantom. Phantom has followed the projection that we talked about in the last video, um, the roadmap pretty much, okay, and we're pushing higher. And in this scenario, I'm now watching if wave C can push a little bit higher. That's wave C of yellow wave two. After the price found support here at the 78.6 retracement in August, okay. So we have an ABC strike, it's a three wave move up so far. It is likely though that the C wave pushes a little bit higher, possibly into the region between 68.8 and 89 cents. Um, this is the sort of upper section of our standard resistance area for yellow wave two before the price could break to new lows. That's the yellow scenario. We don't know if yellow or white are unfolding at this stage because both are corrective rallies. The next pullback, once this initial ABC structure is complete, should give us further clues because if the next pullback is corrective and we should be able to see that in the structure and it's forming a higher low in a support area which I cannot yet define <clears throat> then it's likely white wave B and we can watch for higher prices in wave C for one more high in this cycle and if we are however yeah if, if we see five wave movements to the downside and even break support then it's likely the third wave down that would be a major warning that new lows are coming possibly even below the October 23 low. So in the last update, I also um, looked up what I posted to our gold members. I think it was actually on the, when was that? Uh, 2nd of September. Uh, we talked about this structure here. Let me open that. And the market was just coming down in this B wave, right? So at the time we were looking at 42 cents still. We're now, I think at, um, where are we? 57. So. The idea was, if I make that smaller again, as long as the August low is holding, so that was our invalidation point, right? It's possible that an ABC structure is forming in either yellow wave two or white wave A. Whenever we have two scenarios that might be seemingly different, but they actually point into the same direction, which they did, okay? Because wave A was supposed to go higher in white and wave two in yellow. Well, that can be an interesting structure to look at. And I did highlight that after the C wave to the upside, we have to closely observe the structure of the next decline. That's what I just highlighted. You know, if the structure is corrective and the pullback is an ABC structure, that could open the door for higher prices. But yeah, price reacted here is rallying now in what looks like an impulse, which kind of makes sense because the C wave, even within a larger three wave move, the C wave can be an impulse. So what we can add as well is the 100% extension that is an ideal projection for yellow wave C. It's just an ideal target, you could say, and it points to 73.3 cents. So I leave that on the chart. It's just an additional parameter because we're already looking at 68.8 cents probably as next level. Then 73.3 is a key one. That could be an ideal target for wave C and then 89 cents. Obviously the higher we go, the higher the risk now because we're going f further and further away from um, an invalidation point, which is this yellow B wave. But now it's all about, okay, how high can we go? Because um, as soon as we have top confirmation, then we will add a support area for white wave B. That's the update about Phantom. Hope you liked the update. If you did, please hit the like button, leave a comment and subscribe. And if you really like the content, then please check out the channel membership also. Make sure that you follow us on Instagram and Twitter for additional content. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye-bye.